Hey guys, so I just wanted to share with you a few of the books that I found super helpful in my artistic journey. Um, just a little backstory, I come from more of a screenwriting background and I studied film and media studies in college so I'm now transitioning to visual storytelling and I wanted to help you guys out that may be in a similar position. So without further ado, let's begin. So the first book is Save the Cat by Blake Snyder. Now, I think it's a really valuable resource for screenwriters, but I also think it's great for artists that are looking at a script for the very first time to help them understand why it's being written a certain way. The next book was actually recommended to me by a Webtoons creator. I'll leave their links down below in the description box, but it is called Directing the Story by Francis Glebas. In this book, Francis covers a lot, including camera techniques that help maintain the audience's attention for effective storyboarding. The cute and quick style of his drawings can also be more appealing for artists that are just starting out, as well as veteran artists that may need a reminder to loosen up. And the great thing is, there's even an ongoing story that you can read along as you learn. He's literally leading by example with this book, so it's super helpful for visual learners, especially. The next one. <laughs> this is the Animator's Survival Kit. Now, I don't know anyone that is an animation that has not at least read a chapter, if not the whole book. Richard Williams is amazing. He Oh my gosh, he has stories from, you know, working at Disney with some of the greatest, you know, Milt Call, all of, oh gosh, it's such a good book. This is like the animation bible, like you have to have this in your collection. A couple of other resources that are a little maybe unconventional, perhaps, I don't know, I don't think so, like it, anything that helps you learn and helps you develop your craft, I think, is a valuable resource. So don't underestimate the power of graphic novels. In them, you can learn how to tell a story visually with each panel. There are techniques to get readers to continue turning the pages. Don't underestimate comic books, graphic novels, manga, whatever these are incredibly valuable. One last book I almost forgot, it's called Classic Human Anatomy by Valerie L. Winslow. Now this book it is a textbook, it's not like, oh, today we're going to learn how to draw a sack. No, you're gonna learn the proper Latin terms for like muscles and bones and how they work in relation to each other in a three-dimensional space. All of the scientific terms, it's, it's a very good book. It's not a fast read. Just flip through the pictures and try to make out the gesture lines to help you get an idea of how spacing works in the human figure. But that is also a very good book. So I hope you found this video helpful and I wish you all the best on your artistic journey. Leave a comment below if you have any questions and follow me on the socials for more content. As always, it's been a pleasure and happy arting.